What's up, everybody? Sorry if I look like a hoodlum today, but you know, I just woke up, got a hoodie on. It's like a little bit, it's not cold, but it's like cold enough to wear a hoodie. So I said, fuck it. My hair is a little wild, so we're gonna keep it under the hood today. So today I'm going to be announcing the winners of my most recent challenge, which was the Tagoma Survival Challenge. I even put suicide on it because I thought, I only tried it one time. I didn't win my first try, but you know, there was certain tactics that people used. A lot of people actually did it, long story short. But of course, there can only be three, and these three are the three fastest. So, those three people are our champions. I want to give somebody a title every single time that they are actually the champion. These are the people you should put respect on their names in the comment section below. These three, okay? Last week, you were the Ozoru champions, okay? Alright, so those nine people, because I had a top three in three different tiers, and then, uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Those were the Ozoru champions, okay? So they will forever have that title in my head. So if I approach you, if I see you on the streets, if I go up to you, I want you to be able to be like, hey, it's me. And I'm gonna be like, who are you? And then you're gonna say your YouTube name. And I'm gonna be like, who the fuck is that? And you're gonna be like, Ozoru's champion from tier three. And I'm gonna be like, oh, oh, oh. This week, if you're in this top three, you can refer to yourself as Frieza's commanders. Okay, does that sound cool? Does that sound empowering? All right. That's what you got, so fuck it. Without further ado. Number three. He was a winner in two different tiers in my last challenge. It is Yo, it's Nemesis. Nemesis came in with a time of four minutes and 36 seconds. It was, it was, it was, it, the top three, all three of these guys really amazed me. And what I might actually start doing, just for fun, uh, and don't hold me to this, I'll, I'll, I'll confirm this with you guys, I'll, I'll link up with you if, if, if necessary, but whoever wins, like whoever the number one winner is for each challenge, uh, I'll challenge them to a fight on Xenoverse just for fun. So leisure match will just be, you know, original cast characters. You'll, you might whoop my ass, uh, but either way, it's just all in fun. Uh, we'll just get a little friendly sparring. But, but that's not confirmed. It's just something I've been pondering. I've been really busy lately. Uh, but if I can get something going like that, just for more motivation for you guys, for the winners, uh, then uh, that's what I'll do. So again, number three, Nemesis. Good job, Nemesis. Again, uh, I have a feeling we're gonna see this guy a lot in a lot of my challenge uh, announcements. This guy's always on point. So Nemesis has the time of four minutes and 36 seconds. Our number two runner up is none other than known as Fox. I thought four minutes and 36 seconds was impressive as fuck. I was like, oh my God. Cause when I was watching, I was like, okay, where did he mess up? Like what, what, what made him take longer? But then I looked and when I saw number two, known as Foxy, good job, known as Foxy, with three minutes and 53 seconds. That's a huge difference. Like, if you guys remember in the Grade 8 challenge, especially in Tier 2, like, the times were so close to each other. Like, it was like, they were all so neck and neck, especially in Tier 2. Uh, but in this one, there was, like, some pretty significant separation. Then when I watched known as Foxy's video, I was like, where was the mistake? Like, like, there was, I, and there wasn't. Like, fucking perfect, you know just did everything kind of on beat, on point, did it better than I would have ever been able to do it. Uh, but then our number one, our number one, uh, he was also another, I'm, just, I'm starting to see a trend. So if like there's multiple champions, oh, maybe that's how it'll work. If you win three times, three total, you get like a imaginary token. But if you win three times in the Serie X challenges, I'll face you in a match, just like for fun. Yeah, anyways, our number one winner, he was a winner in our last one. He wasn't the main winner, but he was the winner of tier three. He was the only team team tier three person that, that participated, and that would be Keelan Ransom. Keelan Ransom came in with a time of three minutes and 10 seconds. Three minutes and 10 seconds to complete this entire mission with a pool. He even got the ultimate challenge. He didn't finish the ultimate. He ended up losing against Goku and Vegeta. But the fact that he triggered the ultimate challenge just shows how precise, how fast he was with a pool. Uh, I was dumbfounded when I saw this. It was, it was amazing. Uh, three minutes and 10 seconds. I remember even watching it like three times over to make sure it wasn't bullshit. You know, because I was like, you know, known as Foxy did this so well. Known as Foxy at three minutes and 53 seconds, but then somehow, somehow, Keelan gets three minutes and 10 seconds. It's fucking ridiculous. Once again, thank you for everybody who participated. Even if you don't win, don't worry about it. Uh, it's just for fun, you know, this is really gonna harden your Xenoverse skills in the long run, whether you believe me or not. All right, just have fun. That's all these challenges are about. Something for you guys to do every week. And with that said, Stay tuned for tomorrow. Tomorrow I will either post my next challenge or I'll post something relating to the, to the weekly challenge. Uh, but we'll wait and see. 
Uh, again, as always, thank you guys so much for participating. Make sure to leave a like below. Make sure to find the champions in the comment section below and show them some love. Um, go find their channels. They will all be in the description. The top three are always going to be in the description so you guys can go check out their channels and shit because these guys are, you can tell who's actually like, you know, like these people would actually be good in the competitive scene like in a one-on-one -on -one match sort of thing. So, uh, be sure to check them out. Blah, blah, blah. Thank you for the... Fuck it. You get the point. Wabba. I'll tell you what, I don't really know what I'm doing here, but I was told I can't leave until this guy gets a shitload of subscribers. Now, God damn it! what are you sitting there not subscribed for? There's a like button and a share button. I don't know why I put an H in front of the... God damn it! just subscribe.